Tank it up. Tank it up. I'm gonna tank it up. Let me see. Oh, okay. Mm, nice tank. <laughs> I do have speed this. I think. I hope. Because I'm clicking pulverizing pancake. I had enough of this shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Gator and we're back on Showdown 4, some more Showdown Live action. Uh, happy Thanksgiving to all you Americans over there. It's sometime, I don't know when this is going to go up, but right now it's 3 a.m. in Japan when I'm recording this on Friday. So Thanksgiving is already over. I mean, I didn't do anything to celebrate it anyway, but I, did, I called my parents or whatever. And apparently they have like a whole bunch of family members over there I haven't seen in a really long time. Freaking cousins and aunts and stuff. So if you're one of those people that are lucky enough to spend Thanksgiving with your family. Definitely don't take that for granted. Cherish those moments, because uh, not everyone has that opportunity. But, I mean, y'all are basically my second family, right? So, we on Showdown, and this is how we celebrate Thanksgiving. This is how we celebrate it. With freaking Snorlium Z Snorlax. Now, if you don't know what this does, does it say? Okay, if Holder is a Snorlax with Giga Impact, it can use pulverizing pancake. I mean, you got pulverizing pancake, we got Thanksgiving, they go hand in hand, someone likes it's fat. So, <laughs> we're gonna try it out. Uh, I just want to max attack and max with death. Just because it, it's like, I want. I could go max HP as well. But I just really want to take special, I want to focus specifically on taking special hits if I'm going to, just because thick fat's really nice for stuff like ice beam and flamethrower. Not to mention the fact we also got beware. So like we got this normal combo here and but where's ability is basically weak to fire attacks, and this is resistant basically to fire attacks. So I think maybe work out with each other there. I mean, yeah. Then for the rest of the stuff, uh, we got the Volt Turn Core because we're trying to get these things in so they can hit as hard as possible. I really just want to see how much damage freaking Pulverizing Pancake is going to do to something. So we do have the U Turn and Volt Switch here. Um, I don't have HP Ice or Grass Nut on this, just in case. I don't feel a need to have HP Ice in this format the not Pokebank because there's not stuff like Landorus or like Gliscor I don't think I don't know like I haven't seen too many things to need HP Ice for we're just not going to do that it's on the Calm Mine so maybe in the late game I could just use these two attacks uh, Gengar even though it has no Levitate it's still pretty strong offensive poison types are amazing and then this is also another offensive poison type so a little bit there and this is our Stealth Rocker of course so let's just play I am interested into seeing what Mr. Lax here is capable of. I just want to use it one time. I just want to click freaking Pulverizing Pancake one time. I'm trying to pulverize someone with my pancake. Uh, yeah, he oh, he has a Ghost type, but we have a Gengar, so hopefully that's not too much of an issue. But well, that has Shadow Sneak actually. This could, so this could be an issue potentially, uh, just because. Yeah, <laughs> you, you see why? You see why it could potentially be an issue. Hmm. He has a spinner as well, so just suiciding for rocks isn't the best of ideas. I'm actually going to leave this because he has no ground resist. Not ground resist. He has no ground type. He has no ground type. And I, ooh, I can actually maybe calm mind on this. There's actually no point. I'll just volt switch. And to probably Snorlax. That is so much. <laughs> um, actually, I think Snorlax is okay. Scizor is also okay. Uh, HP fire is a no this Snorlax is max for death. It's here for a reason Okay, I did a lot. Is that life orb? That's not as specs or something. It must be specs or something like that I'm um, thinking just going for a return should knock him out. I Know he has the Mimikyu, but I can just crunch if he switches into Mimikyu anyway So I'm just gonna go for a return here uh, if he goes yeah, so if he goes in Mimikyu, it's fine unfortunately Snorlax can't have fire punch just because of the thing I'm in that does please kill it should kill okay so that's not so, okay so the first game Snorlax does nothing I should have just clicked oh wait never mind <laughs> ah <laughs> completely forgot will he bullet punch does it matter I'm just gonna I'm gonna let me see if he'll let me pulverizing pancake him darn it okay well I guess that's an option too. I was hoping he stores dance and I can just pancake him in the mouth. But that's okay. I mean, I dodged a leaf storm. I don't know how you miss any move on Snorlax. Like, look how big this thing is. It's so big. I really need to like go to sleep soon. But um, I must, I must record for the sake of Thanksgiving. So he goes in Starmie. 
I think Tapu Koko is the switch in. He has no more resist at this point. So I'm free to just click Bolt Switch. Yeah. Cause it should die to Bolt Switch. And if he switches, that's gonna get like, yeah. Oh, okay. This Pokemon's stupid. <laughs> Why did I do so much? I'm thinking I go into Beware. I think it's time. Bring in the monster. He cannot roost on this. I, I doubt it. I mean, if he can, sure. I really hope he can't though. I hope he goes for roost and he gets O code. Or he just says, I'm done. All right, so I guess he's done. I guess he's just done with this. What are you going to Mimi? He, he left. He, he, beware. There it is. He's scared. Got scared of beware. Just, just straight up left. Okay. Okay. I forgot about the wallpaper. We got a uh, Shogugeki no Soma in spirit of uh, Thanksgiving, of course. This dude got a Mimikyu. Again. Why are they, what are people doing in Mimikyu's? Alright, so I can actually lead with my Stealth Rocker against his team more comfortably. Uh, except that's annoying. If this goes for any sort of boosting move, it's going to be really annoying. Alright, cool. Cool, he just cannoned. I'm okay with the cannon. Hmm, I wonder if Snorlax can switch into this. Scizor should be able to switch into this. I think. Aura Spear, about yeah, it bounced off. It did nothing. Uh, I'm just gonna U-turn. He stayed in. Okay, why you stay in, man? Why you go away? Hmm. I'm gonna sack this. I don't. I don't know why he stayed in. To Shadow Ball. That does this like what? So that didn't make any sense. Why he stayed in? Like legit, that it makes no sense. Okay, so we're gonna have to kill this somehow. What's that noise? That was weird. Some weird noise. Question is how? That is the question. I should have just SD'd. I didn't know he was going to stay in. Huh. Snorlax probably lives, but Earthquake's not going to kill. That's a problem. I'm just going to go back into this. I'm just going to Sword Stance. He did get a boost. I'll just roost first. Why am I... I why am I faster? Okay. And he gets a spin. Okay. Go, just go, just go, just click your moves. Like, he's not gonna switch, he's never gonna switch. Just click, kill me, hurry up and kill me. Hurry up and kill me, dude, just kill me. Hurry up, hurry up, I've had enough of this shit. This is actually ridiculous, like he just stays in with this thing for no reason, it's just four attacks, it's garbage. It's a garbage set, it's a garbage everything. What's my strongest move? All right, let's go, let's go. This better just die, this better die. I'm a Tapu Koko, I'm a Tapu Koko. You should just fall over. Okay, like. Like if I didn't, if he was just gonna stay in and just never switch, I would have just set up to plus six and then beat him. But he decided to just stay in, and it worked out for him. All right, that's good. Good on you. Uh, we can both switch here. I'm actually gonna go into Snorlax. I think that's probably not a good idea, actually. Okay, this is banded. This is not banded. <laughs> so I, I think that sums up what I'm gonna attempt to go into. Bulk up Mimikyu. Are you kidding me? Someone get these dudes out of my game, please. Get them out of my game. With Lee. Do I not have points? Oh, I'm playing on Gator. I'm not playing on Derivative. I probably don't have as many points. Because Derivative has like 1300 or something. This probably has no points. Oh well. This has to get points eventually. So. Can you just attack, bro? You can bulk up all day. I got a Gengar right there. And it doesn't even look like you can touch this one anyway. Even though you're a fairy type. I don't know I don't know why you can't touch me. Hello? Are you kidding me? Can you go for your attack? A normal attack? Do you not have a fairy move? <sighs> Welcome to Pokemon Showdown, ladies and gentlemen. Where people can't just like normally use their Pokemon. They gotta use bulk up each life mimic you. And he's still he's still leech lifing. He's he's still leech lifing by the way. Plus three is still leech lifing. Maybe I should have uh got some points first before I played. Because this is just sad. This is pretty sad. It's so cold in here. I need to turn my it's it's so cold. Like I try to keep it off. Cause like it'll pick up background noise. But it's so cold. It's so cold, dude. I think it was like 36 degrees or something. And I'm not used to cold weather. I'm not oh Clean animation. Alright, Snorlax, go do your job. Tank it up. 
Tank it up. I'm gonna tank it up. Let me see. Oh, okay. Mm, nice tank. <laughs> I do have speed this. I think. I hope. Because I'm clicking pulverizing pancake. I had enough of this shit. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I lose. I lose a mini or it was well worth it. It, it was worth it. Why did I lose to this? No. Don't do it, man. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, he's gonna he's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill my whole team with this. Oh man. Um Yeah. Alright, here's here's the plan. Beware tank. Beware tank this acro. Tank it. Tank the acro and one shot him. That's that's the plan. What does more? This is one fifth. This does the same? No, this is stab. Tank that. Tank and that okay okay hold on hold the phone like what is this pokemon amazing so snorlax and beware actually put him put it in the mad work my showdown feels like it's been lagging i don't know like the pokemon are coming out like laggy uh, i don't know if that makes any sense what i'm trying to say but yeah i think you go i'm trying to say but anyways uh yeah pulverizing pancake <laughs> That was my first time seeing the animation, so. Oh, he's Scarf? Oh, come on with that shit. Can I lose to this? I might lose to that. Does this have priority? Does this learn priority moves? No? Okay. okay. We're safe. We're safe. Oh, there, there's Pulverizing Pancake. Not bad. Not bad. Alright, let's, let's go. I'm trying to Pulverize some, some Pancakes. Okay, you got another one. Okay. Yeah, I can definitely pulverize the pancake his team. Um. Hmm. Does he. He has a potential defogger here. Um. This Pokemon's not too worrisome, though, when I have Megasiz. That should be okay. I'm still thinking of leading Tapu, just because he doesn't have a resist, really. Thing is, I don't have one either, so if I leave it there, I might have to just click Thunderbolt. I don't want him to lead Golem, dude. Hmm. If he leaves Golem, I feel like I'm just gonna get screwed over. Okay, my AC is really loud. That's so loud. But it's gonna be so cold without it. I can just edit. I can fix it. I can fix it afterwards. I can just like n noise cancel. All right. So thank goodness I didn't leave with Tapu because I wouldn't have a good switch into this at all. Uh, he has one good hammer arm switch in, so I think that's what I'm clicking here. I could click Earthquake. Uh, what am I wor worried about? Celesteela or Toxapex? Probably neither, because I just go Tabu Coco on both. I'll just hammer arm anyway. Yeah, so I, I don't have to apologize for the freaking... He's 30 and he's not galvanized. He's Helmet Golem. What? Okay. Well, th there goes my beware. What the hell was that? What was that? I don't understand. I'm going to threat number two. Yeah. How did I know you're going to go Zerg? I just knew it. I knew he's going to go Zergatry. All right. Who's taking this pancake? This is everything. So let's deal about to take 60,000% from a pancake. Go ahead. Bring him in. I want to see the damage. Bring him in. Bring the boy in. Bring in the Celestila. Go ahead. Bring him in. Cartana? Mmm. Get Pancake. That did half. We take half. That's plenty of damage. That was actually not that much. But, uh, we'll take it. <laughs> we'll, we'll take it. Oh, that. Banded? That is definitely banded. Yep. And I do have Thunderbolt just for this. So that's nice. Because there's nothing he can kill me with. And I'm doing 65 to him. That's very nice. Yeah, that did zero. And Shadow Ball should kill from here. And it hits everything on his team. We'll just Shadow Ball to finish him off. 
Um, that is banded Cartana for sure. What? It's not banded? It's Scarf? It does that much to Scizor? I'm kind of curious. Is he actually? Yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> you should know what Gengar does. It's not a new Pokemon. Are any of his things? Is this Scarf? Should I keep this? Uh, I tap Coco. It does the same thing. Is this Scarf? This one's Scarf. Okay. Ooh, the, ooh! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! <laughs> he can't click anything. <laughs> he actually can't click a single. Oh my god. Okay. So I'll go into this and I just calm mind in his face. He. Curse body! Hold on! I think that's this is broken. It's not broken, but that's pretty nice. I will admit that's pretty nice. So I just calm mind and sweep his team. Because I am I can guarantee you, if he didn't get cursed bodied, I can't go into this. Because Thunderbolt from plus one is going to do so much damage to me. But now, plus one with the electric terrain, by the way. But now I can just calm mind. Because the cursed body coming through, he can't click shit. Like, he doesn't even, he's like, why is my move not working? Why is my move not working? What can I do? I can't click Thunderbolt. Hello, game's broken, showdown. Nah, nah, you just got destroyed by Gengar. Yeah, you think that's a sack. I'm setting up. Alright, I shouldn't need any more boost though. So, just to start attacking. One by one they fall. And with the Calm Mind boost, I think this dot. What's this more? Thunderbolt or Dazzling Gleam? Uh, no, nah, I can't do the math. I don't even remember how much terrain boosted by. I can't. Dazzling Gleam must do more. Terrain can't boost it by that much. Either way, he's not hit killing me with anything. That does actually that does a shit ton. But he fell he fell over to Dazzling Gleam. Anyway. So who cares? And this is obviously not yeah. Okay. So uh Pulverizing Pancake, not too much of that game, but Cursed Body <laughs> allowed me to sweep. So that's nice. I gotta remind myself to edit the audio afterwards. I I don't know, because like I can see my mic levels and it's picking it up pretty pretty well actually so i guess that's a good thing that means my mic is uh on point i don't know why i ignored him i don't i don't want to ignore people anymore just because uh you know new game people aren't as toxic so okay so he, he has a legitimate team right because he has the mammoth swine so he wants his rocks and he wants his power he wants his rocks potentially his bikes and then his power that's not good for us uh scissor can still 6-0 him because scissor can 6-0 every team um, just gotta get rid of Celestila. Uh, probably Nihiligo. What I'm thinking is he's gonna lead off with this and it's gonna be Sashed. Or something. Maybe. I don't have any hazard control either. This is gonna kinda suck. Okay, I'm gonna lead off with this. Oh, if he lets me damage this, it's over. Like, I just win. So he should switch in talks, but either way, like I'm banded. I'm I want to see my damage. Yeah, I'm trying to see some damage. 574 attack. This is actually really strong. So uh, he better watch out. And he just lets the Celesteela take 67%. Thank you. <laughs> uh, that should be doing half. It is. It is super effective on me. So that is something to note. That flamethrower is super effective, pretty much. Because of Fluffy. Uh, is he going to risk the roll? Am I going to risk the roll? Um, I could go in into Nihiligo. He cannot Heavy Slam. I think this covers a lot of options. So I'm just going to go into this. Yeah, it covered him Flamethrowering. It covered a potential Toxapex switch in. All fine. I think Power Gem kills. If not, T-Bolt will 100% kill. But if Power Gem kills, that's the move to go for. It should kill. That hammer arm should have did more, I think, if he was um spadef. So I think he's fizz def. Oh, he actually went into Toxapex? What? Why? What if I had what if I just clicked Thunderbolt? Um I guess I'll click it now. It's not gonna kill though. Hmm. Or do I get my rocks up? He has a spinner. I'm just gonna click Thunderbolt. Yeah. Oh, I eat that skull. That skull actually did zero damage, bro. <laughs> it 
That actually did zero damage, my man. Uh, hello? Toxbacks? So he's just gonna go into Broken Paramosa. Uh, thing is I have a Gengar, so I don't know how quick he's gonna click the high jump kick. I wouldn't. I would add, I, but like, maybe you just don't go Paramosa then, just go something else, yeah. Makes sense. I can get behind that. He should do this. Mm. So I can either get my rocks up or just attack him. He does have the spinner, but I have Gengar, so maybe the rocks are good. Good. Yeah. What I was about to say, I don't know what I was about to say. Uh, let's see. I think rocks are okay. Ah, uh, damage, damn rocks. We we'll go with rocks. We we'll go the rocks play. I don't know why ice go crash, but okay. Uh, we we'll go into Megasis, and this is what I'm talking about. I think this dies. Okay, it probably doesn't die. It doesn't matter if it doesn't die or not. It doesn't learn roost, so. <laughs> It actually doesn't matter. I'm actually not even gonna bother swords dancing. I should swords dance. I should swords dance. Yeah, since he's not life orb, that earthquake does zero. And I'll just roost here. He's still spamming. Okay, that one did a little bit more. Uh, I'll roost one more time. I don't know why he's not clicking like stealth. Oh, he's trying to punish me. And he doesn't get it. So now he lets me get plus four, which I will take. I'll take my juicy plus four. <laughs> I, I don't know why he's not switching, but okay. I guess he doesn't have a good switch in at this point. Uh, I don't know if this dies from 39, 38. Thing is, flamethrower does not one shot me. Um, I think I'm just going to bullet punch. It's probably a bad play. It's probably a bad play to do that. I should probably switch and like tap Coco. Oh man. I want to just stay in. I'm staying in. I, I might kill. This actually might kill. I'm not sure. Okay, it did kill. Good, good. Whew. Good thing I stayed in. Okay. See, I'm, I'm not a coward. I'm not a coward. So now he just actually lost the game because he has nothing. Well, he brought this back in. So now it actually just dies. I don't know why he brought it back. He needs to go in. He should have went into Greninja. Actually, he just lost. Like, there, I don't know why he didn't instantly switch. He just lost. He just let himself lose. This was all on him. He could have switched into Celesteela immediately and not have to deal with the plus four Scizor instead of plus two, but he decided to let this happen. Yeah, whatever. Uh, I don't think Bullet Punch kills this, but he can't kill me with anything. So, oh, oh I crit him. I don't know if that mattered. Probably, maybe, whatever. Scizor just being Scizor. Nothing new here, folks. Nothing to see. Just move on. Just pretend uh, this is sixth generation. Because <laughs> absolutely nothing has changed there. Scizor is still the sweeping team. And uh, let's try and get another Pulverizing Pancake off. And Scizor can easily sweep this team as well. Well, it depends on his Sil Silvali type. Is that shiny Mimikyu? It looks so weird. It looks really weird. It's like actually creepy looking. Okay, so uh, this probably has spikes and it's probably his lead. That's why it's in the first plot. Um, what can we do to really stop that? Not much. Probably Tapu Coco. This is fine. Civilly ground. Okay, so that's not good for us at all. Civilly ground. That is very bad. I don't know what he's about to do with this man. I'm scared. I don't want to go into Scizor. I'm just going to go into this one instead. Okay, that did 18. <laughs> no no problems here. No problems. Um, I want to Ice Punch. Yeah, I don't see why I can't Ice Punch. Like, if he goes Mimikyu. Like, Mimikyu actually just comes in. Yeah, so we can Ice Punch here. Go ahead and destroy that disguise. And we get to see the uh, the busted. I'm assuming this is a face. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, they don't have the real sprite yet. Scizor should hardwall this. Mimikyu, unless it has Will O Wisp. If it has Will I think if you're going to use Mimikyu, you should run Will O Wisp. Honestly. Like, it's not good as a sweeper. I don't think it is. Because it just doesn't do enough damage. Mm, I'm just going to U turn out. I hate clicking U-turn on Scizor sometimes because they stay in it so annoying. Okay, he did switch though. 
That is a lot. God, what? All right. And um, probably right back in the beware. Yeah. I don't see why I can't go right back into this and just hit this boy up with an ice punch. Hmm. Maybe I hammer arm this time just because I, I ice punched last time and I have a definite answer to Mimikyu anyway. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I can hammer arm. Yeah, I get goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> ah. <laughs> So a lot, he definitely thought I was clicking Ice Punch there, right? But, like, I have an answer to Mimikyu every time. I just go into Scizor, you do no damage. Unless you have Will-O-Wisp, and then it's actually a problem. But he didn't do it. So he's setting up for some reason. Like, it matters. It doesn't matter. He can have plus... He can get another SD up. Look, look how much damage. That is so little. Literally nothing. I can roost up on this. It's at plus two, and I can just set up on this. It's not, it's not that good as a sweeper. It literally needs, like, plus six to do anything. Um, okay. I'm actually unsure of what this thing is capable of doing to my Scizor. I don't even know what to switch into this, honestly. Hmm. Could we probably just Dragon Dance up? I actually don't know. I kind of want a U-turn. I don't know if this gets a fire attack. I'm going to check real quick. Uh, actually, I don't need to check. I'm a man. Yeah, just bounce off. See? Just man. Pure manliness here. Just bounce off. And I can just go into Tabu Coco and start clicking Dazzling Gleam. Because uh, we see his Sivali is ground type. Silvali. Sil Sil Silvali? Sil Silvali? Whatever. And just get this on my face. Yeah. Yeah. And then I guess he can go into Silvali? Sil Sil Silvali. Silvali? Let's go with Silvali. I'm going to keep going to Beware. Like, I don't see why I can't. He hasn't shown anything that I'm scared. So he had this, but he never went for that. Interesting. Uh, at this point, I'll just click return. Like I said, Mimikyu is not a pro. So it's sub SD. Sub SD. Multi attack. I guess. I guess that's a set. I, I don't know. I don't know. I'll use this Pokemon eventually. That did zero. <laughs> His Pokemon are so weak. They're all so weak. <laughs> can't can't handle the beware dude his pokemon are literally like the weakest things i've ever seen all right this will probably be the last one i do have some homework to do what is this duck trio you got a little duck trio bro you got rabombi rabombi's a threat this is an actual threat does he have hazard removal no any okay <laughs> his whole team is like weak to hazards so i'll just get my rocks up if you don't mind or I could sludge wave this. <laughs> I'll probably just sludge wave this first. Yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll take my kill and then I'll get my rocks up. <laughs> I, I like that idea. Dougie. Yeah, Dougie actually. I can't touch it. But we can just get the rocks up now. And um, I could switch if I wanted to. Like, I'm not trapped. So let's actually switch into Beware. Uh, or Scizor. Huh. Maybe just Scizor. Because it's just fat. Actually, maybe I should just. I'm actually going to sack this. I'm just going to sack this. Because, um. I don't, I don't want Beware to take too much damage. But now I can bring it in and start fucking him up. Just completely blowing him away with any move I click. He has no good Earthquake Resist. This is. Rabombi's not an Earthquake Resist. I guess this is, kind of, but it's, it's not enough. I'm just earthquaking. Okay, so that's clearly not a resist. Please, Oko. Maybe the top specs is broken. Do I outspeed him? Yeah, I should. Okay, good. Yeah, he has no resist. Because if he brings in one of these bugs, they take rocks damage anyway. So, that's fine. So, Stealth Rock is still the broken move. Most broken move ever. Nothing passes. I mean, nothing changes with the passing generation. Stealth Rock is still just broken. Completely busted. I am weak to fire, so, but I have a Snorlax, and that pretty much wraps that up, so I just have a Snorlax, and he missed anyway, so whatever. I don't see a reason to click the special move when I can just click Earthquake, 
So I'll click, I'll save the special moves for, for when he goes into a Rackinid. So this should die. Yes, nice death. Good job, Snorlax. Nice death. And then when he goes into, oh, I thought he was gonna go into Rackinid. I don't even think I have to pulverizing. You want me to pancake this small little bee? Like, is that is that PG thirteen? Like, <laughs> I'm just gonna return this. Yeah, I'll 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 pancake the uh the bug. We can, we can squish the bug. Please don't leave. Can I please squish your bug? Please let me squish your bug. No, no. Come back. Come back. <sighs> I wanted to pancake somebody. I'll get one more, one more for the sake of the pancake, and I'll I will leave with Snorlax and pancake. Win or lose, I just want a pancake. That's so stupid. Why you leave, man? I just wanted to pulverize his thing. All right, I can pancake him somewhere, right? Somewhere along the. If I pancake, I'm gonna lose a mini or. Uh. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave. He doesn't have a. I will I will make sure to pancake one of his mods. I promise. Okay, but I'm just gonna leave with this. Yeah. Um, this might be sashed, but I have bullet punch anyway, so I'll just volt switch. Because if it's sashed, I just volt switch into Scizor and kill him. So, and it's not even sashed. <laughs> See why I didn't leave Snorlax? Because Snorlax can't really touch that. Uh, probably just going to my rocker. Man, I wanted to pancake his bug so bad. Oh, I don't want to forfeit. Look, give me my points. I need the points. All right. Uh, yeah, okay. I will pancake his Primarina. Is that is that good enough? Can I pancake the Primarina or maybe the, the Lele? They should all get one shot. I think um, depending on this thing, it's a type of course. Steel. Okay, that does not get one shot. I repeat, that is not a one shot. Hmm. I think Beware was a fine switch into this last time, so it might be this time. Okay, this is a strategy. Get this shit out of here, bro. What is this? I think Hammer Arm's okay. He could go in the Lele. So I could Earthquake as well. Earthquake's probably okay. Just Earthquake him. He went Turtonator. Why'd he go Turtonator? Okay. Uh, This is why we have Snorlax, I guess. I don't know what he's gonna do with this. I actually don't know what he's gonna do. I'm hoping he just fire attacks. Wait, Shell Trap? <laughs> why does Show like a- why does Show the thing up there? What the hell? I don't even know how that move works. I saw the earthquake this. No! 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 Objection! No. No. My pancake! Oh my god. Never pancakes, dude. I just wanted to pancake this boy. Dropping Dracos? Are you kidding me? That's so dumb. What is his team supposed to accomplish? Just Will Wiz, Thunder Wave, and but he has like sweepers instead, of like just bulky folk. I don't get it. Whatever, man. Whatever, you got me. Snorlax is useless, dude. Man. And it is approaching that 30. This is the last one for sure, though. I will I will pancake the shit out of him still. Even when burned. Even when burned, I will make sure to pancake this boy. I'm going to this again. Besides the SD. So I just have to not get parried. And just hammer him in the mouth. That's all I have to do. Multi-attack does absolutely nothing. Hammer arm one shots. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This Pokemon is not that bad. <laughs> like Fluffy is a pretty a pretty cool ability actually. That cause that did zero. <laughs> Alright, he goes he goes into threat. I don't want to just hammer arm this. Do I need this? But I don't need this Pokemon for anything. Yeah, please don't get paired. I want to see some damage. Mmm, delicious. That's delicious damage. And uh, he will kill me with a fighting attack though, if he has it, which he should, because it's a Kamo. -O. That doesn't matter, because I have a. Oh wait, I lived that. Th Dude, that did zero damage. Like. <laughs> Wait, then I would have lived a fighting attack too. This Pokemon is just busted. It just eats up everything. What is this? Like, screw Pulverizing Pancake. What happened? <laughs> All right. Well, uh, that will be it. We, we did Pancake a couple things. Um, clearly, I was just kind of 
want to use some of the new stuff. I don't think this is going to be that good competitively. Uh, I don't know. Maybe in doubles, I don't know about singles though. But this is actually not that bad at all. Like this is just taking up everything. But yeah, it will be end of the uh, quote Thanksgiving live. Leave a like, comment, video. We greatly appreciate it. And let's get around to you guys next time.